Hello one and all, this is Nightmare 10 once again, and I'm here with the recap of the first round, um, slash thoughts of the first round of the NFL Draft. Um, it is over with, done, finished, can't not go back to 2010 Draft for the first round. It's done, second draft starts tomorrow at 6 o'clock, or today at 6 o'clock, it's like right at 12 o'clock, so anyways. Um, just wanted to come on here and give you guys my thoughts. Uh, first pick, Sam Bradford um, with the Rams. I gotta say that I would have taken Sue, um, but obviously, after what transpired, Jimmy Clausen is not uh, nobody is huge on Jimmy Clausen, so maybe that's why they picked Bradford. But another reason for that to go with that, you could take Clausen with your first pick in the second round because they could get him right now. So, do they take Sue? Is Clausen does Clausen go in the first round? I wouldn't think so because now Bradford would drop. So there you go with that. But um, that's the first pick. Sue went, went second with the with the Lions. Congrats to the Lions. Great pick there. Um, they'll definitely uh, enjoy that guy. That guy's going to be a great player for the future. But um, moving on, I'm, I'm not going to go through all the picks. Next big big guy that you know that I was looking forward to was C.J. Spiller. I knew he wasn't going to end up being a Patriot as much as I would love. Um, we weren't going to draft a running back one and two. He wasn't going to get to us unless we were you know, solely going for him and we traded up for him. Well, the Buffalo Bills, I believe, traded. Or did, were they? Was it, was it their pick? No, they didn't trade. It was their pick, um, and they picked up C.J. Spiller. So we're going to have to face him twice a, uh, twice a year. Um, should be very interesting to see what he does. Definitely think, think he's going to be a great player. Uh, then we have... Um, the next big big splash was Jimmy Claus is still out there. He still doesn't get picked. Um, and ended up not going the whole first round without a pick. But someone else did. Um, Denver would trade in, get, trade back into the or trade up in the draft and get a wide receiver. And then they would trade in back into the first round and give up. I believe, do not quote me on this, a second, a third, and a fourth. Maybe two thirds might be in there. I don't know. But I, it's three picks. Um, a lot of people are going to hate on this. I am a big uh, Tim Tebow supporter. We'll see if he's a able to able to you know to get to his full potential at the Denver Broncos. That remains to be seen. We don't know. We can only watch and see. Um, but I am a supporter. I will continue to support Tim Tebow. Uh, I don't like the Broncos. Never have. But gonna have to root for him somewhat. You know, mainly him to do good and maybe do the Broncos proud. Except for when they play, of course, my Patriots. But, um, so that was a big splash. Um, did see, as soon as the Bron Broncos came in, I'm like, you know, there's already been talks about Team Tebow. They had already worked him out. I knew, I had a feeling that uh, t that's who they were going to go after. I was hoping not, but they did. And uh, Tim Tebow goes before Clawson and actually goes in the first round, where, in which Clawson does not. So, very interesting there. That was a big splash, pretty much, in the first round of the draft. Then we, we traded a couple times, the Patriots did, um, and then we ended up going at, Pick number 27th, which is where the Cowboys were. Uh, we gave up there. We traded with them, and they got Des Bryant, which personally, I'm like, get Des Bryant. You know, he's the best wide receiver. We need to fill a void there. But obviously, you know, Torrey Holt, we, we got him. Obviously, you know, Bill Belichick doesn't want to fix that, fix that yet. Maybe tomorrow he likes a lot more uh, wide receivers. I do, do see us getting a wide receiver tomorrow. They have like five second round picks. It's ridiculous. But, uh, yeah, with 27th pick, the New England Patriots, my New England Patriots, got cornerback Devin McCourtry, is that how you pronounce it? Yeah, Courtry, I think. So, don't know much about him. Hope uh, He plays for Rutgers. Hopefully he'll be good. Um, and we definitely need help for the secondary, so there's that. Uh, let's move on. Other than that, I mean, the end of the draft pretty much ended uh, the way, it, you know, casual picks. But Jimmy Clausen, where's he going to go? Where do you guys think he's going to go? Let me know. Um, I personally think... I, my fr a friend made a good point. Um, he said that he sees the Vikings still getting him. Um, they have the now that Detroit traded in or whatever, so the Vikings did pick in the first round. Um, they now have like the second or third pick, so could see that, or we could see people people deal with the Rams to make sure that they get Jimmy Clausen uh, with the first pick in the second round. So definitely watch out. Um, Six o'clock tomorrow, so it could be very interesting second round. Um, as far as thoughts of how they did this draft this year, I thought it was all right. Um, having one round is really cool. It's fast, you know, semi-fast, but 
uh, it just, it seems like, I wish they would do first and second, and then maybe do third and fourth, and then maybe uh, do fifth, five through seven on Saturday, but I guess if they feel like they need a fourth, fourth round, people may still watch on Saturday, if it's fifth, pretty much people don't care, I don't know what their thinking is, but first and second, I still think should be on the, on the same day, so there's that, um, that's pretty much it, um, I hope this video didn't go that that long for you guys. Um, I just wanted to get on here and talk about the draft a little bit. Also, um, a couple of releases by the WWE. Don't want to waste too much time on this, but Shelton Benjamin is the key one right now, and Nikki James. As far as my thoughts, as a TNA fan, do I want them in TNA? Obviously, I want Shelton Benjamin in TNA, but um, TNA's having a huge problem with booking uh, superstars as it is now. Um, so... There's that. Uh, I know I haven't talked about the RVD thing. I'll get into that maybe later. I don't know. It's hard to make videos. I've been really busy, even though I haven't. And I know that makes no sense, but I understand. Uh, um, but yeah, it was school two weeks. We'll see how it goes after school. Hopefully I can get some videos more out there. But there's my NFL draft thoughts. Obviously, when and picked up Avatar today. Blu-ray, DVD, compact. Combo pack, so uh, very excited about that. Um, love the movie. Um, I don't care if you hate, liked it or not, <laughs> personally. Um, it's my opinion. I love the movie. I thought it was good. Uh, I actually thought it was great. So there you have that. And that's it. That's my thoughts. A couple of things at the end, and hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, I'll see you round two tomorrow. I won't be recapping it, most likely, but just uh, watch this round two tomorrow. Hopefully, hopefully your team does good, um, especially if they're the Patriots. <laughs> Peace.